who would have thought that a small little battery in a, in a phone or, or laptop could explode and hurt someone. Lithium ion batteries are everywhere, from our electric vehicles all the way down to our handheld devices. The batteries can last for a long time and they're a reliable power source until things go wrong. And the whole thing comes on down to when they end up degrading, if we end up having water infiltration, if they get too hot, they will go into thermal runaway. And that is a fire that's very difficult for the fire department to end up extinguishing. That's why Chris Pfaff came to San Angelo from Washington State. He's teaching about the hazards that come with one of the most popular sources of power on the market. And everyone is here to learn. Firefighters, paramedics, law enforcement, uh, tow truck uh, drivers, uh, school and safety, security personnel. Pfaff has spent two days in San Angelo teaching two four-hour courses a day. The chance to learn more has brought people in from as far away as Mexico. The big thing we see with these people coming from Abilene, from Mexico, from West Texas, from East Texas, from everywhere, is that there's a thirst for this knowledge to make sure to keep the public safe. And as officials tasked with keeping students safe across the entire Concho Valley sit and watch, they now have information in their back pockets that will allow them to prepare for the worst as they hope for the best. You know, for our school folks, it may be 10, 15, 20 minutes before first responders can arrive to take care of an issue. And so they have to be able to prepare themselves to own those first few minutes. I think that's kind of the takeaway for me and from the education side. And even first responders with decades long careers are jumping at the opportunity to know more. It's always good to keep learning. And uh, whether you've been doing it five years, 21 years or 50 years, we have some firefighters here that have been doing it 50 years and they came to learn. And that's what it's all about. All of the dozens of attendees over these past two days now have a chance to do their jobs more safely and effectively. And whether you're a first responder or an everyday average Joe like me, the perspective is extremely valuable and a change to the everyday life. From the Region 15 Education Service Center, Sean Humphrey, Fox West Texas.